The fourth layer is used for ad hoc record sharing. Now, at the time, you couldn't do this in, in, in Lightning. Um, we had to switch to Classic, I think. So uh, please bear in mind that this little video might be a bit out of date. Um, but what we do with uh, manual sharing, yeah, switch to Classic. What we do with manual sharing is open up access on a one-off basis. So there's a button on the account. And what you're looking at here, oh, what you're actually looking at on that page when um, when she shows you, where are we? What's am showing you? Yeah, so this here is a list of all of the entries in the share table for the account. And it tells you who's got access to it and why. And then when you do your manual sharing, all you're effectively doing is creating a new sharing, one-off manual share, share record in the share table in the background um, that is gonna open up access to Laura Garza. And you'll be able to see that from the, from the sharing reason on the right-hand side, you can see how and why that user has access to that record. So that's the first place I go when I'm troubleshooting and testing. I love testing sharing, I can't help it. Um, but when I'm troubleshooting and testing and someone says, I can't see this record, I'll go and find it, click that sharing button, and it gives me a list of all of the reasons that people have got access to it, including role hierarchy, et cetera. Mm -hmm. 